Hi, this is David Papkin with TSI Consulting Services. Welcome back to deploying and managing Windows 10 using Enterprise Service. In this video demo, it'll be about direct access, implementing direct access, configuring the direct access server, configuring the clients, and validating remote connectivity. So I'm going to right click start, network connections on here. I'm going to disable and re-enable the Ethernet adapter. I'm going to disable and re-enable. And then this is going to make the, the domain profile um, load on this one too. What I'm going to do is Tools, Remote Access Management, I'm going to click on Direct Access and VPN and run the Getting Started Wizard. I'm going to deploy Direct Access only. And on this one right here, Edge 131.107.0.2. Next. Click here. And you'll notice that you're going to see two GPOs have been created. DA server settings and DA client settings on there. Now next to the remote clients, I'm going to change. I'm going to get rid of remote computers on there. I'm going to add the type DA underscore clients. Let's see if that shows up. Good. I'm going to clear enable DA for mobile computers only. Next. I go to the PowerShell, have restart computer. Good, so I'm done with this. Now the next thing I'm going to do is configure the clients. I'm going to validate the group policy settings. What I'm going to do is restart this one. Because of the group policy, I'm not sure if that group policy is computer policy. I'm going to restart it. So I want to see now if those, hmm, let's take a look at it here. Ah, I want to see if that profile is applied to here too. Your filtered out server. Good. This one's applied. Good. Very good.
Good. The DA settings are inactive when the computer is inside a corporate network. Next thing we're going to do is validate the internal connections. Go to Internet Explorer. Good. I get the default internet web page. I'm going to do is this. The file explorer. Okay, I'm able to access the folder content. I'm going to enable this. And here. Yes. So I've made sure that this is displayed. The DNS has displayed this. Good. And this one right here. Good. Cancel. What I'm going to do is verify connectivity to the internal network resources from the public. Let's see if we get on here. All right, so um, notice now I can still do as on this. I can still um, uh, connect to the internal network resources. Good. And I'm going to do is in the file explorer here. Jesus, so fucking slow. And direct access here. And you can see that I have here Windows 10 Workplace Connection.
and you can see that I'm using Gene Kerberos and user Kerberos. Well, this will conclude this video demo. This is David Papkin. Thank you for watching.